Hello there everybody, I'm Bix here back again with a mock from my Lego City and this is really just the standard size for a lot of my buildings, just uh, this kind of smaller plate. I forgot the exact measurements, I believe it was like a 18 by 18. Uh, yeah, it seems about that, I don't know. Uh, or 16 by 16, yeah, 16 by 16, I believe. But um, yeah, uh, this is a fast food restaurant, uh, specifically McDonald's, and I use the yellow red color scheme to good uh, use making half the building red half the building yellow if you're wondering why a lot of my buildings if you do follow me uh, are uh, two colors or more it's because uh, lack of price you know but um, there you have the M right there um, I use a jumper in the middle to get that nice M right there and it's pretty plain from the back and yeah this is actually a to-go window and we'll see how that lines up on the inside but the whole roof as expected can be peeled off. Again, figures are not um, official. I make them all myself, uh, just with parts, and um, I do have to add more, but the door opens, and um, it doesn't hinge open, unlike the toy store, but yeah, that wouldn't even help that much, actually, so let's raise this a bit. Uh, off to one side, we have two tables with red and yellow stools. The other, another table with red and yellow, though, uh, if we can do this, you see how uh, reds are diagonal and the yellows are diagonal as well to add a bit of flair. We have a chef kind of in the back right there with uh, two mini sandwiches and one jumbo one. Uh, there, oh my god, that is supposed to be like uh, in the process of making a sandwich. You get this right here on, sorry about the, the choppiness of this, I'm holding it in hand, but uh, you have a the patty cooking right there two cups and a nice soda fountain right there even some grating to where the soda would go if it fell that's a pretty nice build i think uh uses those old mega or you know sometimes they used to use them as megaphone pieces to good use and good effect and a burned fish right there yeah never ordered that fish fillet probably isn't gonna like it right there so uh we do gotta sink so the figures can stay as sanitary as possible when making the food and here you have a tiny cash register a place to hold money and that is sort of the speaker they tuck into because here on the other side as i said before is a to-go window but that is just really kind of it with the whole uh, mcdonald's restaurant mock on the whole but let's see how it fits into the city as with the toy store carrying my mock in one hand and my um ipad or camera in the other hand there you can see where the McDonald's goes, next to the toy store, or uh, specifically next to the ATM, which I've done videos on both of those. And you can see some tiling and plating down there. And then I need two hands to really get it in there, but that's where that goes. So yeah, but too bad the to-go window is actually covered up by this furniture store, which I still have yet to review. But that is it for this video. I hope you liked it. And if you did, please subscribe, leave a comment down below. And I'll talk to you again soon. And by the way, this is uh, the first time I did it by accident where I was just zoomed in a lot, like halfway, and then I zoom out all of a sudden. But now I thought it looked kind of school cool when I like show where my buildings go. So I think I'll do that in all of these. Bye.